name is Kimberly Hilton and I just wanted to come on here and show you my ultralight um, kit that I've been taking out lately um, just to do a little um, plein air painting. This is just something that will fit in my pocket and I want to show you what's in my kit and um, it consists of, I just added the pen today but normally it's just a pencil. A little tiny sketchbook. It's I think a two by two inch sketchbook. A little tiny wooden palette, and it's magnetized. Um, uh, you can find these uh, on Etsy or on Amazon. Uh, I got mine from a um, the artist who created it, which is the Go Draw palettes and um, they're a little hard to get um, but there's all kinds on the market these days and I just wanted to show you um, the clip that I came up with um, that I've been using I've, I've lost my other one so I'm gonna have to make another one so what I do here is uh, this clip is just a little bit I mean I guess you could do it like that but it's just a little bit wide for this. So what I found that if you just take some pliers and I couldn't find my other pliers so I'm using these jewelry pliers and I'm just going to bend up each corner. So the metal's really easy to bend. I got these clips. Um, I think I ordered them from Walmart but you can find them anywhere. They're just magnetic um, like paper clips or bulldog clips or something but um, office clips and then I put that side right there and so that's going to hold my palette together in my sketchbook and this was the um, painting that I did yesterday of, um, of the rocks and um, I just went down there to um, do a study because I was having trouble. I was working previously working from a photograph that I took last fall, which is this photograph. And everything was really blue in the photograph, and you know I can't really tell all of the. I can't really tell all the shapes because the the photograph really flattens things out. This is the painting that, um, the studio painting that I've been working on, but I, you know, I just wasn't satisfied with the colors and I told my husband, I need to go back down there and I need to see it in person. So, um, this sketch, you know, it, it's hard to stand and paint and try to create a masterpiece in five or ten minutes, you know, but, um, it's, I did get the colors that, you know, that's going on at least right now. Um, I saw that there was more greens and browns and, and grays in the landscape. But um, this is uh, just how I, I do it. I just um, take, take the clip and put it there. And then I have this little tiny, um, this is like just a generic mint tin. And I have a paper towel in it, but you can transfer the paper towel there and fill it with a little bit of water if you want to use a regular brush but for the sake of um, and also those uh, little magnets there help hold it on too so um, but the clip is just extra insurance and then you know I can hold this in one hand I have you know my little blotting area and I just use a water brush um, I'm not the biggest fan of water brushes I, you know I've you know sometimes they just make it too wet I have a little tiny um, travel brush that I can use but I don't normally don't normally use it but I do, I do have the option to use that and um, just a regular pencil that I've you know sharpened till it's really short and this which I've not used yet but I may use it as a little wax resist crayon and um, I thought maybe if I wanted to save out some highlights that I could do that but this is just uh, what's in my kit and um, it's real easy and portable 
I don't even have to have the, have this. This is just a little like, makeup uh, bag or something that I found. And uh, I'll just put everything inside here. It'll fit in my coat pocket. Um, if you don't have a bag like this, you can use a Ziploc bag, which I've used before. And that's all I need to go paint. And I find that, um, you know, I have other painting kits that are a lot bigger and heavier. And it's just not as convenient to take out. And I may or may not feel like painting or, you know, or say something I want to paint. So um, this works for me. And uh, so I just wanted to share that with you in case you all um, wondered about uh, what, I, what I use to paint with. So with that, I'll um, talk to you later. I'm going to go for a walk and see if, um, if I run into anything. Have a great day. Happy painting.